What's up, everybody? Shotguns and mud mowers here. Yeah, and as you can see, I bought this chintzy Chinesium fucking impact driver. The battery does not come all the way clipped in. You gotta give it a little fucking slap. Get her into place. I'm surprised it even came charged. This thing cost me $40. I'm gonna see how well it can drive some screws. I just bought this thing today. For a cheap fucking driver, it feels good in the hand. But of course, like all cheap tools, yeah, they always feel good in the hand. Until you put some real use to them. Well, that fucking screw didn't want to go in too fucking good. I'll try this rusty piece of shit right there. All right, I'll try this deck screw. In case y'all are wondering, I am driving these screws into a two by four. We'll try these three screws right here. Kind of hard to do this with one hand and everything fucks up on video. Nice. It's not letting the smoke out yet. Alright. And this long screw. These are just random screws I found laying around in my shop. Let's test it out. Alright, so I managed to drive through two pieces of plywood into a 2x4. Alright. See if I can do this with one hand, get the bit out. You gotta slide the chuck forward, pull the bit out. Kinda sucks recording with just a phone. And I got this nut driver out of my Stanley set. I'm gonna see if this thing can secure my vise. That fucking bolt popped up. Oh, it didn't fucking grab it that time. Oh. Well, there's no locking thing on the back. Doi. No, I look like a fucking dumbass. Alright, it's in place. Let's see how well she goes. Oh, well, the vice is secure now. I'm gonna, gonna double tap. Oh, it's starting to get a little warm. It's in there. Tighten that one up for good measure. All right. So right out of the box, it works fucking mint. I'll have some more testing for it in another video. Hope you all like this one. Please like, subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next one.